This is a video that I'm making because recently I was watching one of Bin Jing's video. He was talking about how do you overcome other people's negative feedback or criticism um, or other people's negative activity. And this is what he said. He said that, what do you get when you squeeze a lemon? You get lemon juice. What do you get when you squeeze an apple? You get apple juice. What do you get when you squeeze someone who has a lot of positive energy? You get a lot of positive energy. And what if you squeeze someone who has a lot of negative energy? And you get a lot of negative energy. So whatever that they're saying, it doesn't mean anything about you. So one of the things that I find that it is so important, especially when I work with my own clients, is the ability to separate out the other person and yourself from them. Because when we grow up, we sometimes tend to get attached to what other people say. Maybe our parents will say, um, you, you may do something and then um, your parents doesn't approve of it and then they say, oh, I'm so disappointed in you. Um, you bring shame to the family, etc." And then so your action is very attached um, to their reaction. And so it, there's a connection between the two of you. So you feel very responsible for other people's reaction to you so that when other people give you a negative feedback, you think that it's because of you. So one of the things that I teach my clients is to separate out yourself from the other person. May they be um, someone who's very close to you, like your family member, or someone you're just passing by and they have a bad day and they start yelling at you. And so if, you, if we look at all of these things as in lemon, apple, positive, negative and whatever you get out of squeezing those things it has nothing to do with you then you can say okay well he's giving me a lot of or she or she's giving me a lot of negative criticism or energy but that's that it is her fault it may be her fault i may be frustrated or angry about it but what do i believe about me and being able to separate that out will help you define what you want for yourself and you can determine your own course of action. So I just wanted to share that. Um, that's it for today. I'll see you next time.